Hey guys, welcome back to Jurassic Collectibles. Just a quick video to show you this. It's this month's Total Films Collector's Edition, which is a Jurassic World Collector's Edition. It contains four gifts. We'll have a closer look at those in just a second. And it does actually open up and has a sound effect built in. Pretty cool to recognize that technology has got to the point where you can actually put sound effects into a magazine, uh, much like a greetings card. But uh, yeah, it's quite cool to see that as an added extra. It does come in this cardboard box. The standard edition does not. Um, and there's a nice little quote from Jeff Goldblum on the bottom. It says here, I'm 20 years older, but in fine fettle. You are indeed Jeff Goldblum. So the four gifts are, we've got a Jurassic World employee pass, Jurassic Park 36 page celebration mag, a Jurassic World art card and a free ebook. So uh, yeah, let's take a closer look at what's inside. I'm using a trusty pair of scissors here. Remember kids, if you're using scissors, you should be okay actually with a pair of scissors, but if you are using a craft knife like I usually do, then you want to get adult supervision for a craft knife. But a pair of scissors, you should be okay, as long as they're not too sharp. So let's open this thing up. Jeff Goldblum's in fine fettle. There we go. So we've got the magazine. Come on out. Oh. Okay. So first off, we've got our Jurassic World employee badge. Let's take a look at that. It's a pretty nice little prop replica. Animal tracker. Jurassic World 045. It says uh, copyright Universal Studios. And there's a nice little Jurassic World logo on the back. So that's a nice little freebie and you could customize it, take this out, make your own. It's a nice little added extra to this box set. Then we've got the Total Film Mag. And then here is the Jurassic World uh, art card. So actually it's a poster. Very nice. It's on a nice uh, thick paper stock, glossy finish. So you could put this up on your wall. It's actually very, very nice, just as a standalone little poster. So there's that. Then we've got the Total Film magazine with uh, Owen on the front. And uh, it looks like the animatronic Indoraptor, but I think that is a CG version. I don't know, it looks CG augmented. Just try and compare those two. Yeah, this one looks much more CG than this one. But uh, yeah, very nice artwork on the front. We've got embers swirling around the bottom there. And I think this art is exclusive to this box set, the collector's edition. So that's nice to see on the back here of this uh, collector's mag, it says, your scientists were so preoccupied whether or not they could, they didn't stop to think if they should. Ian Malcolm, very nice too. Jurassic Park, the Jurassic Park story. Very nice. Celebrating 25 years of rip-roaring dinosaur cinema. Indeed. So let's open this up, see what we've got. Very, very nice. See what sort of pictures we've got going on here. So this is a very nice glossy magazine. Got some nice images to celebrate Jurassic Park. So I did actually see this on someone's Twitter feed. It's actually a bit more of the theory behind the T-Rex attack. And they propose that the T-Rex breaks out one place and then pushes the Jeep over another place, the Explorer, sorry, over another position, which I'm not sure about. Um, but yeah, very cool, nonetheless. And then we got a bit of that about the Lost World here. Nice little bit, classic scene, trailer trashed, Jeff Goldblum. There's a bit about Jurassic Park 3 here, so I'm gonna enjoy reading these. A bit about Chris Pratt, someone who actually deals with animals. Giving a little insight, expanded universe. Very cool. Oh, cool, so they've actually recognized the comics here. Very nice nod for us collectors. Oh, look at this. And a page full of merchandise. Interesting. Look at the ones they've picked. So uh, we've got Alan Grant there off Color Alan with the command compound. Interesting the stuff they've picked there. They've got the Chaos Effect Thrasher T-Rex. Some plushies from Jurassic World. Well, they've got a little image of some Jurassic Park bedroom merchandise. The animatronic Spinosaurus. Very nice. It's nice that they've recognized the collectibles. Then we got a bit about Jurassic World. Let's just skip that bit. 
And then we've got Jurassic Interconnected World. Okay, um, Bryce Dallas Howard, screen test. Interesting. And then at the back, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom and a nice image of the T-Rex. So it's not all Jurassic Park stuff. Um, there isn't much in the way of exclusive photography or any sort of um, extra tidbits, but I will give this a read and see if there's any extra info in there. But um, it's more like an overview of uh, all the films, you know, all the way through, rather than just focusing on Jurassic Park, which is the, the one that's celebrating its 25th anniversary. So it's an okay magazine, but um, I was hoping for a little more. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I've got to read it first and uh, hopefully it will be filled with some interesting tidbits. Um, I'm assuming this one's got an article on Jurassic World. So let's just see if I can find the page 54. Parks and Recs. Okay, so here we go. Article about Fallen Kingdom. We've got some nice photography there of the Indoraptor. Some nice images here from the film. There's an interesting image there of Blue in front of a cage. It looks like he's eaten someone, one of the guards maybe. I don't know. But yeah, I haven't seen that image yet. Uh, any more extra cool images? We've seen that image. It's probably my favorite image I've seen for years. And then what else we got? Okay, blue. A little bit of the Indoraptor there, a little bit on J.A. Bayona. Oh, they've got a an exclusive deal on um, the Pop Funkos. You can get Dr. Ian Malcolm and a T-Rex Pop vinyl figure with your six month print or bundle subscription. So that's pretty cool. And you'll get this um, special Indoraptor eye print. And then I think that's it. And then it's on to the solo story. So um, yeah, there we go. That's the brand new collector's edition total film. I just wanted to do a quick overview. I think the main features are the fact you get this cool poster. I think this little prop badge is cool for kids and they can customize it. And I do like that sound effect. Okay guys, rate, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.